Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 37, and this is war number 11. Just one more war after this one, and we are done. We're going up against an alliance called Chosen One. I'm assuming that's five, not V. All right, let's see. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's uh, see who they banned. Quake, Hercules, and Ghost. Interesting. All right. See what they got in store. Okay, so. Oh, I don't have anyone there. I think towards the end of the season, folks know what they're going to end up. And so they're just kind of more relaxed. Although I do hate fighting Jabari. I really, really do. But uh, I will bring in Namor again. Yeah, I'll bring in Namor. And who do we got here? Oh, we got Havoc. Ugh. Um, I can do that fight with uh, Nick Fury. Hmm. Triggers a buff. So it's immediately nullified. So anyone that either doesn't gain buffs or is immune to nullify can do this fight. Or at least handle that node. Ooh, Mystic Dispersion. I haven't seen that in a while. Yeah, whenever a buff expires or is removed. Okay. Yeah. So you really want somebody that doesn't gain buffs or cannot be nullified. Like Thing. But my alliance mate goes in here with someone who I think is perfect for that fight. So I'm going to leave that fight to him. Uh, I can bring in someone. Let me see. They banned uh, Spider-Man 2099 because I would have used him for that. Um, and some of the champions that I have, I think uh, Overseer, I think is immune to nullify. So he would be a good uh, option as well. Um, but I'm going to let him handle that. Ooh, okay. We've got a Penny Parker up here and Doom. What do you know? Let's see, Mystic Dispersion. See, I hate when I look at it like this. Ah, I can't really tell. Let me see. Let me look. I'm trying to see because when I look at it that way, I can't tell. It looks like they are Mystic Dispersion. Okay, so. The icon there, I'm looking at uh, Kitty Pride here. She's a Mystic Dispersion Defender, I'm assuming, because she has that icon. So Doom, Penny Parker, and Black Panther Civil War are not. And if they are, I'll just wait for them to take down the boss. Hopefully they don't need me. Uh, if they do, we'll just carry on, because there's nothing that we can do to up our uh, our tier. We're going to end up in Platinum 4. All right, so I might bring in Nick Fury. Well, that penny is annoying, but I'll bring in Nick Fury. Um, Namor and... Actually, I don't need Nebula. So I could bring in Claire. Hmm. I might try to switch it up since it's, uh, you know, the final wars of the season. I might try to switch it up. And uh, so, yeah, Nick Fury, Namor, and maybe I will try um, the Overseer. That'd be interesting. If not the Overseer, then I'll just bring in Claire. And um, they might need Claire for maybe that Hulkling right there. So I might do that just, just to be safe. Yeah. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. All right. So you see I'm going in here with Nick Fury, Namor, and Magneto. We actually brought Magneto in for a change. Uh, and you'll see that fight. Uh, it was a very interesting fight. 
All right, so we didn't have anybody to fight on this first node. And we've got Jabari Panther to fight here. And I've gotten a little bit better at fighting Jabari Panther. She can be very annoying. She has a very fast, it's like she's unstoppable um, when she does that cleanse. So you have to be careful. You can either intercept a lot, like you see me doing, or if you parry, don't try to attack her right away. Just don't. And I like her special two better. That special one uh, always catches me if I try to evade it, if she has enough charges. Now you saw right there, she there was like no pause. I just blocked. If I had tried to actually block and then attack real fast, I wouldn't be able to do it too fast. So best just to block. I would not want to face her on a node where you get really high block penetration, but you just have to keep on uh, intercepting her a lot is all. All right, so that was pretty much it for section one. And I still haven't used any of these. I love that they're there uh, and I plan to keep them like if there's an emergency. All right, so already cleared that mini right up there. We've got three hours left. I came in all kinds of late. All right, so this first fight here, I, well, sometimes I get caught. He can be pretty annoying at times. And if you're not paying attention, he can wreck you. Uh, but in any case, uh, I think I brought in uh, Nick Fury on this fight. I'm trying to remember. It's been a while uh, since I actually did this fight. But I think I used uh, Nick Fury. Now, <clears throat> here's something that I learned. And you're going to learn it too with me. Don't use Nick Fury for this node. All right. Watch Nick Fury's health. Watch his health. Okay. Now there's an armor up. Look at his health now. Look. Boom. Real Nick Fury's out. Now I'm like, oh crap, I'm trying to get it fast. Done. The faster I tried to go, the quicker. Don't use Nick Fury on that fight. Uh, what happened there is every time he got an armor up, you had a chance to put a bleed on you. One bleed is not that bad, but they stack and you saw what happened. And so when I saw that, I went, oh no. And I tried to go faster. All I did was get the stacks on me faster and I died faster. So yeah, that was the first and last time I used Nick Fury on that fight. Should have been a quick, easy fight, right? Yeah, the node got me. That's why you saw me kind of chuckling because I did remember uh, that. He just got wrecked. So you want to go with somebody who can either nullify the armor ups um, or somebody who is bleed immune but yeah don't don't try nick fury them two lives went by real fast didn't they all right so here's one i wanted to see how well um he went he did and if you'll notice the boss is already down so i, I don't have to deal with the global so um you know she's metal and so I'm like, okay, I should be able to, to do this pretty easily. All right. And I'm just, you know, trying to get the shield down. And then I was thinking, you know, I probably don't have to get the shield down with uh, Magneto. He might shut that down. I'm not sure, you know, but boom. Now I'm starting to do the heavy attacks. Okay, just boom. The shield is not completely down, but it's getting there. All right, there we go. Now it's down. So now I should be able to not even have to worry about it. Just, just boom, boom, boom. Look at the damage. When, when Magneto goes up against metal champions, he does lots of damage. And then I got caught there. It happens. All right, so now, boom. Now see, I saw auto block failed. And that's what I was thinking. I might not have to worry about her shield. 
So I could have maybe done this fight faster. But, you know, I didn't know. This is how I'm, I'm used to fighting uh, Penny Parker, you know. But it looks like he does shut that down. Yeah, see? Auto block is failing. Anybody else, she would have auto blocked uh, the heavy attack, but not him. And at this point, I kind of wanted to try and get to the special three. And uh, build up. And I don't remember what we did here um, in this war, but you can see here, I was trying to trying to get to that special three, but I was like, you know what? Let's just finish it. Uh, I wanted to finish it with the, you know, special three crumple, but didn't happen. All right, now we've got Doom. Now I had planned to use Nick Fury for this Doom. That's who I wanted to use for this. But as you saw, Nick Fury went down really, really fast. And now I don't have his life model decoy. But like I said, I don't remember if at this time we knew we won or we knew we lost. I can't remember. But anyway, so I brought in Nick Fury. I even used an involve, so it might have been a close war at this point. And really, that's all I needed, because now I can just go ham. And I, I ain't worried about no doom. All right, so bam. Interception right off, right in his face. Look at that. More kicks to the face. Look at his health. Almost like they did me on that other node. Look at that. We're just looking at each other. Boom. Done. So that was it. Didn't really need the invulnerability boost, but just like insurance, I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. So no problems uh, using the invulnerability when I didn't really need to. Nice uh, piece, uh, peace of mind, you know? But anyway, we'll be back in a moment and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back and unfortunately we lost this war um, didn't look like it was that close. Let me see. Was it? Yeah. It didn't look like it was that close. Um, we died, uh, too many times. All right. Um, shout out to Nabi Dian, Joker, and, uh, Manasu, uh, for being the MVPs. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all... Have a blessed day.